In this tutorial, I will show how to change a clutch. It's called freewheel in a Bafang electric bike motor. It's a Bafang BBS02. Um, and the symptom, the reason I want to change freewheel is the fact that the pedal spins in the air without transferring any power to the chain and the wheel. And first I want to show this thing that I'm going to replace. It's a chain ring and a pedal free wheel. It enables the uh, wheel to spin in one direction but not in the other. Okay. For this we need some tools. We need insert keys, screwdriver, impact screwdriver and hammer for the tough uh, screws, uh, an angle plier and preferably long lasting grease. So the motor has been removed from the bike. We start by removing the crankshaft seal. Then we remove the two axle retaining nuts. The chain guard is removed by removing the five screws. Next, the chain ring is removed. Then the gear house is opened. Before opening the gear house, clear the sand and dust from the outside. When removing the axis, make sure that the beads of the bearings doesn't fall out. Take care of the bearings on the other side as well. When removing the securing ring, use uh, angled plier. Oh, yes, nice. Oh. Okay, 
and down. If you move this plastic, these are really hard stuck, so you need an impact screwdriver. It looks like this. And here is as far as we need to go. The teeth on the cogwheel here is very torn out due to maybe misuse or overloading of the bike. And uh, that's why we need to replace this. And meanwhile, we'll also change this uh, pedal free wheel. So, whereas this goes actually in both direction, if you put some strength on it, this new one, the chain ring and the pedal free wheel, assumed it's put down the correct direction this way rather than this way this doesn't work but in this correct direction it indeed does work so this is what we want the new pedal freewheel and the new chain ring gear and you compile them So now we just compile everything again. Here we need to use the impact screwdriver again to fasten the screws extremely hard. Once done, we put on the plastic magnetic disc again.
put back the second axle retaining nut. And then put back the crankshaft seal. Then I put a lot of grease around the chain gear. Once we have done this with the grease, we want to put on the lid. And finally we put on the chain guard. And that's it, we are done. I hope you found this video useful. Uh, good luck repairing your bike.